Alrighty, alrighty. Hey, what is up, everybody? It's Trey Hardy here from the good old Kill Instinct Squad. Playing some more of that Man of Madon, but we're playing the Curator's Cut. You know we beat the game, so uh, let's get on with the show. Let me send some invites, because terrible on YouTube, this was originally a live Twitch broadcast. The Dockside Market. All righty, Buster. We better mosey on back to the ship. Whoa. Stop the presses. What? Looks like old Charlie Charming's got a little business to attend to. Young Shi. Can I fight? Hey, give me a quarter. Why? I'm gonna find out my future. Heck yeah, I can fight. Okay, I sent some invites out. Okay, take that, bitch. Oh. Gap. Ooh, gotta be quicker than that. Oh. Oh, you ain't sure you could be bored. Oh. Oh. Take that. Oop. Oop. Take that, bitch. Some kind of a karate master, huh? No big deal. Sure. Tell your friends about me, huh? Okay, pal. Spread some of that good fortune around. <laughs> sure. But I gotta try out Mr. Punch him up. Good luck. You, uh, you got another quarter on you? What do I look like? A bank? Okay, old timer. What do I got coming my way? All right, time to get our fortune checked. Yo, even ma. Let me do hopeful. Will Joe return us two quarters? You think old Joe will ever make <coughs> good on that 50 cents I just invested in him? <coughs> Water rooster. Uh, I'm gonna go with water. Can't say, Jump. I got so. Me can't tell the shama. Well, that is a flower. Okay, yeah, it's a flower of some sort. Need a Huh? What's that supposed to mean? Hey, buddy! What the hell are you talking about? Hey. We should probably make our way back to the ship. 
don't, don't know what he's talking about. About. He's, I just need one more try at this. he's on that crazy Turn shit. Back, like now. I love games like this. It's like watching a movie where you control the outcome. That's not good. these real quick ten what a dick ten days in the brig I'll go getting that open bunch of bullshit. out of here already what the hell is going on up there I heard aircraft and gunfire me too and there was a a corpse 
What? In the sick bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. Did I do this right? I mean, nothing's gonna happen if I fuck up. Hey, big noob, what's uh, how's it going? Brother went to sh sit on the shitter and accidentally had both lids up. L, <laughs> oh man. Been there, done that. Christ, another boss. Shit. Buckley. Well, he did. Last time I saw him, he was fine. I mean, he was even jonesing for extra security detail. <laughs> At least it's not one of us. Okay, here we go. Hey, Chuck? You see that kid over there? Uh, no. You feeling all right? Where am I drink? Let's go check out these dudes over here. Joe, get over here. All looking like they had their soul snatched. Yeah, you make that face, she know what she's doing. Be nice and dear.
Oh, hell no, nah, bitch. I can't believe they really censored him getting thrown out of the boat. That's PlayStation Plus for you. comes the beginning of the game or oh, the intro I'm gonna let this play mute my mic and smoke me a cigarette won't you spare me over till another I know one of these days I'm gonna play a game straight through to the end. Ah, you're back. These games take like four hours to beat. I could do it in the stream. Excuse me a moment. You've heard, I suppose, that there's been an adjustment. It's a one door closes, another opens sort of thing. Yes, the story's been told, but the truth of that story isn't fixed. Far from it. You see, a story can change a great deal when told from a uh, different perspective. A chance to turn back the clock, walk in different shoes, make fresh choices. Perhaps take a few risks this time. Raise a little hell. Now we're going to play the same way I did last time. Ugh. Excuse me. So it's like a sequel to Man of Medan, a prequel. No, uh, this is the creator's cut. It's like the director's cut of a DVD. But you play as different characters. 
Well, not different characters. Uh, they're in certain parts. You'll swap characters. I can't wait for that new one to come out. The Devil in Me. I already pre-ordered it. Think we got enough? If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look, I've never been down there before. Down? The water, diving. Well, maybe you could show me how the pros do it. I'm say encouraging, of course. Dude, of course. Yeah? I'm like practically a dive master, man. But I gotta tell you, I'm tough. No special treatment. You gotta do exactly what I say. So I gotta do what you tell yep. me? Yep. So you're like my boss? Kinda, yeah. You gonna pay me? <laughs> Whoa, careful. That dive cam is like super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. Why? We'll just do that and shit. Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Dude, you know I'm not like the best around new people. Whatever. But shut up. I'm gonna say supportive. Brad, you're not on this trip because you're my bro. I mean, you are my brother, but I mean like we're buddies, you know? Um, kinda. I'm just out here to fucking hang, cool out and kick it. What the fuck are you talking about? Let's just kick it and be legends, man. <laughs> All right, amigo, Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry I'm a little snappy, I'm just... The new medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia, it's been rough. Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. No worries, man. I'm almost done with my cigarette. <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah, I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. Hey. So, uh, can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? Just, uh, kind of a big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? I don't know what's the right thing to do. Go with your gut. If it's right, you'll know. Bearing updated. There goes Julia. And of course, Conrad. Oh, sorry. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. Bradley! <laughs> I feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. Miss me? Wanna crack the cold one? Every second, be romantic. Every second. Ha. Uh, that's a lot of seconds, cowboy. I mean, I would have gone with minutes. Way less needy. <laughs> so, first dive, you and me? I... If you can keep up this time. Uh, say I promise, Brad. Ah, damn, Julia, I meant to tell you. What? I kind of told Brad I'd take him on the first dive. Brother thing, you know? Really? Alex? You promised. I... You know what? Fine. Whatever. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Where's the old crust bucket skipper anyhow? I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... So is everybody on board and ready to go? Am I still banned on TikTok for three days? Yep.
I can't post none of my Thanos quotes until what? What was I say? Saturday? Fuck me. Oh, good thing I got the backup page. That's it. Get it all out. Uh, yeah. <sighs> You, uh, want to go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Yeah. Oh, boy. Let's see those hot picks. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are... Cool. Well, hot diggity dong. Look at this. Alex, come here. I think we got something. A nice dive. I'm so sure we'll be here. Yeah, I mean, what are the odds we're really gonna find a needle in a haystack? I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? Feast your eyes on this. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Fliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, yeah, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Wait, are you saying we shouldn't dive? Be supportive, guys. Look, I think we got to listen to our experienced, beautiful, smart, and beautiful captain here. If she says we should do things, Honey, the right... please. I didn't bring you on this trip to get laid. Wait, what? <laughs> no, 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 no. It's not. I, I, I'm just saying she's right, not because she's beautiful. I mean, she is beautiful, but that's like a coincidence. I was trying to get him some. Look, we paid for this dive generously. We're diving. You're the client. But if anything goes wrong... I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine? Untouched? We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. right -o. Hey, maybe you should check hey, out Hey, little bro. boy Blue, what's going on? Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, he is trying to clap. Alright, got some Apex Legends going over there. Blue playing some Apex. Dying Light 2 just installed, okay. I should stream that one day, but I need someone to play with. Hey. Hey, back. Hey, sis. Mm-hmm. Hey, Connie, how's it going? Trips are for relaxing. Oh, work, work, work. I thought we came on this trip for relaxing to the maxim. You've never worked a day in your life. Excuse me. <laughs> what I do is hard work. And hardly working. Yeah, you should see how these rebreathers work if you're planning on diving tomorrow. Blah, blah, blah. Whatever. Gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. Just following the rules. Hey, she's all right. She's just a bit of a stickler for the rules. The word is bitch. Hey, look. She's not going to be down there with you. She can't stop you from doing shit. Connie, you got to keep it in your pants around Fliss. Just cool it with all your desperate pickup. But she's right there like she don't hear them. Desperate? Like I could charm the fish from the sea, sister. Just you wait. All right. I'm going to get these rebreathers set up and then we'll go through the final steps together. Great. 
I'm gonna kick back and uh, enjoy the sights for a little while. And by enjoy the sights, I mean I'm gonna ogle our captain like a grade A creep. Yeah, I got it. Gross. Hey, at least I'm honest. Still gross. Please do not fondle machinery you are not equipped to understand. You might want to just let it do its thing. Oh, Captain, my Captain. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. At least you showed me a little respect. Even if you're the only one in the group. Mr. I like it when you're strict. Hey, I like it when you're strict. And sometimes I just want to be kept in line, you know what I'm saying? I don't mind a little submission now and then. Is there no way for you to turn that off? Turn what off? That thing where you have to hit on me like every two seconds. Uh, I'm gonna say, is it working? So, is it working? Do you have brain damage? <laughs> Am I upstairs brain or my downstairs brain? Ugh. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? Say, so, well, I've got experience. Oh, I got experience. In all the right places, if you catch me. Yeah, I caught it. And I tossed it back. And Damn. where might that experience lie? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Huh? For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. Why am I even talking to you about this dive? Clearly, you have other things on your mind. I'm mm, thinking about getting wet. Oh, don't be fooled. All I'm thinking about is getting wet. Okay. Because, you know, when I get that dive suit on, it's going to get hot in there, sweaty. You know, I think you need to work on your material. Go take a stroll. Come up with some better jokes. Damn. You got turned down like a motherfucker. All right, need that. Well, hello. Got that premonition? How you feeling? Shouldn't have had that beer. Uh -huh. no I was gonna say the other one. We'd be hanging up top. Should you care to join? <laughs> yeah, I'll be up as soon as I <clears throat> stop puke heaving. Wow, I can't unhear that term. Locker, what you got inside of you? Trial of Innocence. Interesting. What's this now? Fancy. Get on you, Alex. Well, that's an actual book in real life. I think tomorrow I'm going to stream that Call of Duty since it officially launches. I have it pre-ordered and everything. I think this might be bogus. Okay, so this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Okay, 
O2 check done. Whoa, 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 Eager Beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. Thanks for sending me straight. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. They looking for a first mate? Looking for a first mate, Captain? You need look no further. <laughs> Very funny. Deep connection between us. I just never knew that it was possible to feel such a deep connection with someone. Like right off the bat. Synergy. You know? What is it with those guys? They've got a whole ocean waiting for them and they're still on deck. I'll shoot them overboard. Hey, what's the hold up? Let's get diving. My boy Conrad trying to smash. I bet the pictures don't unlock. AKA premonitions. Bro, that dude had a camel toe. What the fuck? Whoa, you good? I thought I was trying to look, it was right there in my face. You had a fucking kitty print. Too bad Fliss is so tight. She acts like we're going to ransack the plane. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> not like they can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. Need me another tattoo. drink. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. The turret. We can get in through there. Close one. Whoa, careful. Could be dangerous. Uh, ladies first? <laughs> Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time not exploring. Go, go, go. No, 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 I need to go back. It's right there. Hmm. I think I already got it. They already have that one. I need to get up there. Call of Duty Modern Warfare. There we go. I need to get up there. Julia, leave it. You don't have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? 
live a little. Don't be such a gonad. I'll be fine. Gonad? Seriously? Am I dead? What's happening? Live a little, Edgelord. Just the octopus. Stupid down here? That's it. One chance. You get that? I know what I'm doing, okay? I know what I'm doing, okay? I don't need a lifeguard. This says it was a rescue plane. Launched from a U.S. base. They were on their way to help out a ship. down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. One of the rescue boats is missing. <coughs> Alright. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. Good God. Oh, he did. He's holding something. happen here and we'll look at things they knew they were goners uh you hear that let's check it out yeah let's do that Wanna go first Remember, first time I played this, I jumped like a motherfucker. Pilot and co pilot. Gotta be. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. Howdy, Captain. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh and eager cabin boy. <laughs> Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Say, hey, sure, why not? Sure, why not? Pretty nice ride you got here. 
Where'd you get the cash? I'm gonna say it's a long story. It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. Try me. Well, it involves at least several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. Oh. That's very kind of you to offer. I suppose we could have that conversation. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Weather looks clear. Mm. I'll have to keep an eye on those clouds. Uh-oh. It's getting mighty crowded out here. Or you looked at that premonition. Let's get the one out of this bathroom. Why do I keep these around? How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Say, so, hey, it's your vacation. Hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. What do you know? What do you know about this wreck? Just rumors and theories. I got tired of the speculation and wanted to see if there was actually anything there. What got you into World War II? What got you into World War II? Just stuff I read about in school. Then I found out my grandpa was in the Navy, got lots of medals. I wanted to understand what he'd been through. Got me hooked. You can use those you old can stories. You use all those old World War II stories to help them find the sites? Yeah. You know, when they started wreck diving, I realized I could be a pretty good resource. I knew a lot about where, where planes would go, shipping routes. You make a lot of connections. Alex and Julia have done a lot of dives, but I gotta say, finding this plane takes the cake. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check you later. Hey there. How's it hanging? You look like you're taking full advantage of your relaxation time. I'm a man of many talents. I'm gonna say, so are you beached? So are you beached? Like a whale? Hey, I just thought, why spend all my time down in the dark when I already like what I see up top? I'm gonna say, nice one. <laughs> nice one. How long you been cooking that one up? All afternoon. Good use of your time. I like to make the most of it. Mm-hmm. I'll see you later. Hello again, little blip. What you doing all the way out here? Duke of Milan, 20 miles north of the coast, over. Reading you, how can we help, over? Looking for a weather report in my area, over. Got a severe front heading into your vicinity from northwest. Thunder, lightning, 21 knot winds. Keep an eye on that, we'll check you in the AM rounds, over. Appreciate the heads up, but we got this under control, over.
There they go, right there. Duke to Alex. Duke to Julia. What's that about? Fishing boat from the looks of Fishing it. Fishing boat from the looks of it. How should we handle this? Be quiet and let me handle it. Uh, we? are not doing anything. I'm the captain, so- I'm gonna put this in a short break. I'll be right back. I'll use the restroom. Be quiet and let me handle it. You got that? We got divers in the water. Guys, you gotta keep back. We've got divers in the water. Damage here, you see this? Look at our boat. We can take care of this, man. It's not a problem. What do you think? Like, uh, 10 bucks cover it? <laughs> Whoops, my bad. Let's make it 20. Well, shoot, Kong you, you think asshole. More like 30? I can do 30. All right, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. Let's go. No! I guess they didn't need the money. You're an idiot. You are an idiot. What? They left, didn't they? That doesn't make you any less of an idiot. You got a funny way of saying thank you, Conrad. You're a piece of work, Conrad. I'm not all work. I'm a little play, too. Are you trying to flirt with me? Is it working? I don't even know what it is. Well, when you think of something, I'll just be over here taking in the view, flirting up a storm. Hashtag wink. Okay, I think they're on their way back up. And I was getting used to it just being you and me. We need to light the grill. Oh, oh, pick me, pick me. You can call me Grill Capitan. You may light the grill, but I will never call you that. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, damn. 
am, Fliss. I I'm sorry. Restrain. This is my fault. Damn it! This is my fault. My boat, my fault. Hey, what the hell is going on? Uh, hey, JJ, don't worry about it. It was a little was mishap. A little, uh, mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. So why are you paying the ocean? Ugh. Comrade threw money away. A group of fishermen came by and damaged their boat. Well, they got caught Ooh. on the dive line. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. So then uh, Ambassador Conrad figured the best move is to show him he'd rather throw away his money than give it to them. You're an asshole. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge, full of cool stuff. Unfortunately, we did not leave it as pristine as we could have. What? Why? The dive line, actually. How bad? Uh, there's no cockpit anymore, for starters. Oh God. Well, that's just fucking perfect. You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad, trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. <sighs> if only she felt the same. What about Conrad? A bold fellow, you might say. Or maybe you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss, strong, Forthright, stubborn. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. Let me reassure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. And some I think they may regret. Yeah, like Con well, Conrad, dude. <coughs> How well preserved was the plane? Brad, it was insane. It was like traveling through time. No shit. Well, it was like traveling through time and accidentally ending up in a dimension where the past is underwater and everything is covered in barnacles and sharks. Sharks? Yeah, well, just one shark. Ah. Hey, one was enough. <sighs> Wasn't Comrade gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. <sighs> Excuse and since he me. Was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. Can I ask you why you said no? I just thought it was the right thing to do. I don't understand. I, I thought everything was going so well. I know I should have a better answer. Oh, crap. This badge. Conwyn Island. Julia. I was totally right. I don't know what that means. It was my gut reaction. I don't know. I should have explained myself better, but I didn't. Oh, God. What does this mean? Does this mean we're over? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we should just... Uh, take some time apart to cool off when we get back. Fuck. Fuck. Let's just have this trip together. Just keep things the way they are. For now. For now? Yikes. This thing looks so fake, it's almost real. Why wouldn't it? I'm the one that could be comfortable, right? I'm sorry. I can't deal with this. I need to find my brother. No, no. You stay here. I'll go get him. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's go get him. Sure. So, which one is, uh, 
you know, where the magic happens. What's your problem? Give it a rest already. Okay, that's enough of that. Conrad, beers, where are they? Oh yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. All right, now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Uh, in the plane when it broke. Alex, holy crap. Were you guys like in the plane when it broke? Oh, got out in the nick of time. Skin of our teeth. Well, our skin was almost in a shark's teeth. What? Uh, yeah, didn't I tell you there are sharks around here? Uh, no. I no, you didn't. dangerous. Oh, yeah, the, the friendly sharks. I'm gonna say respectful. How do you think the day went? Other than our little tight 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 with the locals? Pretty good. People always say they have dive experience, but Alex and Julia seem to actually know what they're doing. So, we're going again tomorrow? But he can't wait. Sign me up. Can't wait to see this sucker for myself. Uh, I'm gonna go find Julia. Bradder for Brace and Lee. You got a girlfriend? Uh, I'm gonna say assertive. Uh, yeah, I do. I, well, I mean, I, I did. I broke up with her, though. Just too much to handle. Women, right? <laughs> hmm, yeah, women. They exist. You're correct. They definitely exist. Especially the one you just broke up with. That one, for sure. I'm gonna say, what about you, Fliss? What about you? Are you, uh, with anybody? <laughs> uh, no. Not currently. Right here. Hey, well there, sailor. Um, excuse me? Careful. If you did decompress too fast, then you should go easy on the beer. Uh, Alex, I'm fine. I think if I got the bends, I would know by now. Not always. Sometimes the bends can be super delayed. I mean, it could be hours or a day or two. The bends? Yeah, it's, uh, when you come up from a dive too fast. Oh, 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 yeah, uh, uh decompression sickness. <laughs> Nerd. Little nitrogen bubbles that get stuck in your bloodstream. Hurts like a bitch. It's really serious. Divers get sick and die from decompression sickness every year. And that is why the good Dr. Conrad says drink them if you got them, because either you're fine or you're going to want a little something to ease the pain. Julia, I'm telling you not to drink any alcohol right now. Oh, come on. Telling you? Take orders from this guy? Just drink a beer. Beer o'clock. Well, I wouldn't have done that. All right, everyone. Check it out. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if- Hey, Dolly the Gamer, there. what's up? Thanks for stopping by. Uh, anything else? There was a flight plan on board that seemed to indicate it was a rescue plane. Yeah, that makes sense. A little quick After shout the war, out. They turned long range bombers into rescue planes. And then this plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. From the photos Alex took, you can Pulling see in the back rooms. One of the corpses. That was like GTA 5. Conwin Island, smack dab in the middle of the Pacific Theater. Called it. Reckless, all of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey, they were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. Oh, come on. No one knows we've even been down there. And I don't think ghosts can talk. You Americans are all the same, huh? No respect for anyone else's traditions. 
You should have never gone down to that plane. Plus, got the DSLs and dick luck. sucking lips. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? So yeah, I heard a story. Yeah, I heard a story. It happened right around here too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Scare away, little bro. Okay, here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? Where'd you hear this? If you need to know, it's ripped right from the rotting pages of the terrifying ancient in-flight magazine I was perusing on our way here. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. Shh. The woman answers, I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an ax. Always an ax. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? Okay, fine. Then it was a meat hook. They were slashed with a meat hook and hung from the rafters. So gross. Okay, so who did it? The woman says, it was my brother. And she turns to the closet and says, he's hiding in there. Oh, great. Blame the brother. So the lighthouse keeper creeps over to the closet, opens the door, and... Sure enough, there's a man inside. But he sliced out his own insides with a meat hook. Horrified, he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. And he sees. It's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> Yuck, so ah, gross. Horrible. Hey, oh, super twist. Nice. Nice one, Squire. You have me going. Pretty cool. Hit me on the cheese there, corn dog. Okay, you've all had your fun. We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? Uh, it's standard issue. Okay, so big new 51s from protocol. TikTok. Okay, I was wondering why that name looked familiar. Uh -huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? No, I specifically oh, so target women and children. To drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just <laughs> oh yeah, the remember no Russian website. video. And four good buddies. And I'm out. Sucks I'm banned on TikTok till fucking Saturday. I can't post shit. Well, I can't have my backup. Bitch, take this. Oh, 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 never mind. <gasps> Is 
ill though ass knife. Okay, I see that command's broken. Gag. Is these are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh, god damn it, Conrad. Great, just great. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How was that good news? I thought you were gonna ask the good news first. You're such an idiot, Jesus. Uh, untie. We have to get free right now. <sighs> we're not gonna lie, homie packing. Oh, no dice. No homo. Oh, shit. You know, Julia be drooling during gray sweatpants season. <laughs> Bitch. Ah, fuck him. Ah. You gonna throw a punch at me? What you think is gonna happen? You later. They're just asking questions. They're beating Conrad. God, Julia. They're beating the piss out of Conrad. We gotta get out of here. What are they talking about? Who gives a fuck? I'm gonna kill every one of them. We can't blindly attack them. We can't just blindly attack them. We need a plan that can take them all out at once. We need to get free. First things first. Oh, ah, I got it. I got it. Yes. Yes. Always pack a good cuticle clipper. Oh, 
Oh, Jesus, Conrad. It'll be Fliss and Julia breaking heads, not the other way around. Fliss sure seems to be getting buddy buddy with him. Uh. Unexpected guests. Are you being polite to our unexpected guests? Oh, yeah. We had biscuits and tea. All right. Turn around. I'm gonna put us in another break. Gotta use the restroom again, so be right back. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Can we get Julia back? Maybe we could take him by surprise. Okay, they're coming. Oh. Fuck, motherfuckers. Julia, tell me what happened. They asked about parents what how much money they have <sighs> now we just have to wait and see what they want to do with us Maybe we can take it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a speedboat. The main guy here. And he's got a gun. If we play our cards right, we can catch him by surprise. Take him out. We should just rush him. Take the gun. They can try to fight back, but if we had the gun, they'd be forced to surrender. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. It's too loud. They'll hear it. But we're gonna break them during the thunder. <sighs> Good call. I climb out the window, climb around the side, and hit them from there. We'll take them from the other side. Don't leave us here, okay? Okay, let's do it. Bitch. Here. 
Give me that. Stop struggling. Stop your struggling. You want me to cut you? Huh? Is that what you want? Stay back. Keep your eyes open. <laughs> oh, damn. Olsen! Come here! Which one of you is gonna tell me about this Manchurian goo? Equal rights, equal lefts. Let's go. <laughs> hey, Parrot. You gave me your best shot. All right. Comment of the Shut day. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> oh, give me a break with that gangster shit. I don't think you fully comprehend the severity of your situation, sister. This is right. Hey, come on. We're just passing the time. No big deal. Keep quiet. Captain says shut your mouth. You shut your mouth. Uh-oh. Sit still, all of you. You, come with me. Hey, leave her alone. Alex? Say, are you okay? Julia, are you okay? Uh, yeah, I'm fine, but it seems very possible nothing else is. Hey, that's enough. No talking. I sent summer camp. Couldn't talk at summer camp either. Hey. Alex, just shut up, okay? It's very important to this guy if you haven't noticed. Hey, move it. 
Now! Thanks, I guess. Anyone know about Brad? Is he hiding somewhere? I don't know where he is. Hey, Mecca, what's up? He said you were live earlier? Okay, oh, I wasn't notified. It. it could be our ticket out. He'll be okay. Brad stays hidden. Better off down there than with these. Do a quick shout out. Oh yeah, great. He could get killed down there. Brad's a big boy. He'll be okay. And it's probably better for us if he stays put for now. Well, that might explain a lot. Oh. 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 I did check out that past broadcast. Everyone's still alive. Things could have been quite different. <sighs> Kind-hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning. Get the suit up for come. food now. My stream later. Okay. Tempted? I'm off tonight, so I'll definitely tune in. You're going it alone. Independent. Admirable. Possibly foolish. We'll learn soon enough. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I presume you're eager to get back to your story. But here's a thing. Everything may not be entirely as it seems. <sighs> Probably shouldn't have said that. Probably shouldn't have. I think this is where I'm going to save the game at. Junior, you retire la tête à l'image. Yes, I am, but this is the creator's cut. This is a different version of the game. <laughs> Go. What the hell is wrong with me? Fuck you. <clears throat> my hair stick up so far it's gonna jump on my neck. <clears throat> 
Okay, I'll do Whoa. I did not sign up for a trip to Creep Town. I don't like this place at all. Was a smooth old ship. But was like, oh shit. You're in part to see. Okay, all of you into the room. Plus sexy ass. What the hell is this fucking place? Dude, even those meatheads seem spooked. Manchurian gold. You think this ship is the Manchurian gold? We are in the vicinity of those coordinates. We can't just sit around. We need a plan. We're not exactly in the best position to be making any moves. The second they let their guard down, we gotta take advantage of it and get off the ship. Yeah, man. This whole rust bucket's one tetanus shot from the bottom of the ocean. We already tried to escape. Didn't exactly work out. We gotta get back to the boat and find Brad. What happened to him? No idea. They swiped our distributor cap. Gonna be difficult to get anywhere without it. So can't we just, like, hotwire it or something? You cannot hotwire distributor cap, okay? These assholes knew exactly what they were doing. While those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold or whatever they think they're gonna find on this floating coffin, we gotta take advantage and look around for a way out of here. I wonder what happened. Excuse me. Et on a des prisonniers. Ça va trop loin tout ça. Vos gueules. Fermez à tous les deux. Je suis votre capitaine et je vous ordonne d'obéir à mes ordres. So, when we told you this would be a quick little adventure, was there something in this small print? Hey. I just wish I knew what the fishermen were planning. So maybe they'll let us go. Maybe they'll let us go if they find all that gold? Gold that might not even exist? And it's pretty unlikely that they're just gonna let us go. Marine's not gonna help. We 
gotta figure out how to get out of here. So, Blue. what do we do? I think we should escape is our only option. Escape is our only option. Kidnappings rarely end well, even if they think there's a ransom. Hate to break it to you, but I'm not a rich girl, so it's not like they have much ransom for me. We gotta find Brad, too. Uh, excuse okay. me, sorry about that. We're not that. gonna do anything from in here. We need to keep looking around and try to find a way out. I'll take a look around. I know it's right there, but let me explore this room a little bit more. Guy Miller was really freaked out. This is creeping me out. Looks like he left. Gotta take a wonder why it's abandoned. How's it looking? I can't get it open. Come here. We can bend it open and get out of here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We don't know where a vent like this would go. Wherever it leads, it can't be worse than here. Oh, oh yeah, again. Wall. I'm gonna say I got this. No, I got this. Someone should create a distraction. This is gonna be loud. Let's say barricade the door. Wait, wait. Maybe we should try barricading the door instead. I'm the reason she got snagged. No way. No heroics. Oh boy, still trying to clasp some cheeks. We can. Oh, shit. You're right.
Oh. Frank. I just want to know where the hell they all went. There should have been dozens of people on board. Hundreds. the ship well fuck me Definitely not walking back that way. God, I wonder if Fliss is okay. She's a tough cookie. What are they doing to her? Jay, you're gonna drive yourself crazy. Just hope for the best, okay? Oh no. What is this place? Engine? Well, is there anything we can use down here? We're gonna need the distributor cap back. If we're ever gonna get out of here. Well, that's a lot of people who are suspiciously nowhere to be found. Maybe everyone's hiding in the hold for a big surprise party. I thought someone was standing there. It was Conrad. Yeah, man. That's a, that's a crazy game right there, that Plague Tale. The first one was crazier. Yeah, that game I played last was actually a sequel. Think it's safe to grab it? <laughs> we gotta go get it. We gotta go get it. Yeah, can't go. Such a good idea, huh? Yeah, man. Not worth it. Okay. Qui est là? Vous entendu. Qui est là? Ah. 
Arrête de crier, j'essaie d'entendre ce qui se passe. Je crie pas Ta gueule. Je veux savoir où sont les autres. Speaking of rats. Where are you taking me? Now, why would I tell you? <sighs> tell me where we are going, damn it! Hey, Jack, not 2000. What's going on? Let me do a shout out. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, okay. That's a classic right there. You don't even know what you're doing. You just do whatever he tells you, don't you? Stop. We'll play that Kingdom Hearts. I see you started a little walkthrough on uh, Gotham Knights. I was watching on YouTube earlier. <coughs> I'm about to finish that bad boy up Come tonight. On. Weird to pick that game. That seemed like an older clip. These fucking places cursed. Okay, am I stuck? Is this a glitch? Keep moving. I don't even know where the fuck I'm at. There we go. Jesus! Whoa! Oh Christ. Oh Christ. That guy. That guy's probably still right here with us. I mean, you die on a ship, your ghost stays on the ship. Come on. You have no idea what you're talking about. When you nut and she keep on sucking. Huh. Where did all your 
your friends go? I don't know what the fuck this is all about, but we gotta yeah, keep moving and find Olsen. Now. Olsen? Merde. Qu'est-ce que tu fais? Uh oh. What was that? He didn't lost his shit. What the hell? Still got some to go. There we go. Hello? Is anyone there? Can't be a good sign. Oh, Jesus, what happened down here? Oh shit. Yeah, I don't blame you. Man said I'm too black for places like this. Are you sure? Oh shit. Shit. Oh no. Uh oh. 
bitch ass off me. What are we doing? I thought we were following them. We gotta keep our distance. This way we can get ahead of them. Let's hope it's faster. I got this. Hope oh, sauce. <laughs> I'm gonna take yet another break because I gotta use the bathroom again, so be right back. But you hit anything, you're going down. Wait a minute. We've been here before. Uh, I don't think so. Oh, I swear we've been here before, Alex. Have you been leading us in circles? Come on, guys. We gotta keep moving. Ugh. Soup du jour, mademoiselle? As if you know your way around a kitchen. Well, oh, you know, learn. if we were gonna get married, I might have shared some of my culinary skills with you, but... Just stop. Yeah, for real, super right. not, I'm out. This place? I'm thinking we gotta go through here. Uh, got a picture on the wall. Looks like I already had that one. This isn't right. <laughs> what? What? There's something in here with us. Did, didn't you? I mean, did you hear anything? No, I heard was you screaming in my fucking ear. Keep moving. I know I saw something. It was moving in the shadows. Probably just rats. Rats. Probably just rats. That's all it was. Don't fucking laugh at me. All right, we've been here before. I'm sure of it. We're going around in circles. Well, what do you want to do? Turn around? We've seen all this before. Okay, no. This isn't working for me. What? <laughs> Gross caskets and crappy chapels. Not my scene, you know? 
I must say, it is crappy. You're right. It's gross, and it's crappy. We gotta get out of here too sweet. And we gotta find Fliss. Okay, so can we just get the fuck out then? What is this? Hey, we got a name on this guy. And what are they even doing here? I don't think stuck on a ghost ship for all eternity sounds like a good plan, eh? Who cares where they're from or where they're going? They're dead and we're not, so let's keep it that way. Human? What's the deal with this place? That is some bad mojo, dude. Okay, leave. Now! Leave, leave, leave! Got some serious locks in these caskets. Why would they be chained and locked? Well, that's one way to end a relationship. Yeah, it is. Look at this one. Like for a kid or something. <laughs> I don't want to know. Let's get out of here. Yes! Maybe that's little baby Dracula. Right there. And those are his parents. And they're lying in the dirt from their native country. And then they all jump on Conrad and eat off his face. <laughs> the end. What's the matter? Shh. What is it? Look! What? Seriously? Are you trying to freak me out? Huh? Can we just get out of here? Yeah, we can. Can we please hurry? I'm done sightseeing. Roger that. We gotta get close. No time to What the hell is making that sound? Uh, oh. Why so spick and span? What? Fuck! Hey, this is no time to be fucking around. I'm serious. I can't take it. Why did you touch it? Yeah, super all the way the fuck out. Connie? Connie? Connie, where the fuck are you? Where is Conrad? He must have gone on ahead. Huh, <laughs> super nope. Too anxious. Hey, Conrad! Where the hell did he go? Right behind me, I saw him. I'm gonna go to that fountain. Maybe from the other side.
all sorts of satanic symbols and shit. I got some nice titties. Oh, fuck me, the ass. Let me text someone something right here real quick. Remy Ma and Rhapsody on DJ Premier Beat. I'm about to check that one out. Shared the reel. track is called Remy Rap. <laughs> I'm gonna get that bad boy to listen. Remy, I'm 
for that fool. Sounds like a snaps. We left off where Brad woke up out of his room. Fuck. All right. All right, let's go. Buck up. Buck up. You Sit back, relax, and watch the show. Hey, Dean Wolflore, what's up? Thanks for stopping by. All right. All right, all right. All right, buck up. Do a quick shout out. Last playing Overwatch 2. I have yet to play that game. Holy shit. My boy finna catch tetanus with walking around his ship with no shoes on. Oh shit. It's mid. Yeah, he do got some dirty ass feet. All right, that one's locked. See what's in here. Damn. Holy shit on a shamrock. What happened here? Right, let's go check out these guys over here. Might be mid out of, might be mid, but I played the fuck out of it. That's what's up. <coughs> Skeletons. Skeletons. Skeletons? Where's the skin, guys? Where'd all the skin go? That's going to come in handy later. Some sort of altercation. All right, some type of clue. My English is garbage. I'm sorry, it's early as fuck. Yeah, it is. I was going to stream some uh, Call of Duty. I'm going to do that later on tonight. Alex? Julia? Oh, oh hell no. no.
Uh oh. Vortex, hey, what's up? Thanks for stopping by. Oh, hell no. Don't hit him, don't hit him, don't hit him, don't hit him. There's a reason for that. Last played Persona 5 Royale. What's this clip? It's like some retro. Oh, hell no. Get your ass off me. Bitch. No, you don't. It doesn't work. Six hundred K gamer score, that's what's up. Drown this fuck ass. Oh no, stay your ass under there. Stop! Stop! Come on! Drowned his ass. What? You. You okay? Thanks. I could have drowned. I can't believe it. You killed him. You killed him. They have a choice. Fuck! Whoa. That was a close, intense one. <coughs> Got my vape because I'm gay. <laughs> no, it's better to smoke these indoors than actual cigarettes. Oh, damn! Can you feel a tank top dollar in that? 
you get to get these guys that are not screaming the crowd. We're taking it a little too far. You know, you get my drift. Look, I gotta be careful here. Connor, I can die. Get rid of these guys. I'm with you. Conrad! God, he was terrifying. Conrad! Hey, it's me! Conrad! What the fuck was that? Hey! Where's he going? Shit. Yep, he's hallucinating. Another clue. Francisco? Oh, that's Conrad. Oh, I gotta get to him. Well. I can't open this thing by myself. Got another clue? Talking about the two from the beginning of the game. See what's in here. Service medals. Huh. Where there's a key, there's a lock. Conrad, it's me. It's Fliss. Oh, 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 it's me. It's Fliss. It's okay. He's hallucinating the nurse. Shit! Boy, hallucinating.
Okay, I get this dude before he kill himself. You're gonna get killed! You gotta stop! Yeah, seriously, get this dude. Come on, don't do it, don't do it. Reassuring yeah, sure. Conway, it's okay. Hey, 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 it's okay, it's me. Connie, it's Bliss. Conrad? Come on. Come on, please. Okay, we just saved Conrad. Another character that didn't die. Now I gotta save these two. No, 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 no. There we go. Just save two characters. All five are united. We gotta get somewhere safe. Oh yeah, definitely good. That's a little Bear break. Taking a turn towards the spiritual, wouldn't you say? Uh. Uh. Have you figured out what's going on? How to stop it? How to save the lives of your poor, unfortunate stowaways? You will, I hope. Although it seems the ship's previous occupants never managed to. 
quite a lot of deaths that night. Let me help you out, give you a little hint. I need some help even though I already know what to do. Well then, how can I put this? There may be forces at play here that are more scientific and even some that are more political, you know? Less supernatural. Perhaps you've started to realize something. That everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. Yeah, we already know it's that, that damn helps. gas making people hallucinate. Well, aren't you excited to find out what your poor unfortunates are making of all this and how you might avoid any more unnecessary tragedy? <sighs> Go on, back to it. Speak soon. <clears throat> Excuse me. What the hell is wrong with you back there? What? Brad, you lost your shit, like, big time. You almost killed me. What? What are you talking? Come on. No. Oh, come on. That's ridiculous. Well, what the fuck is going on with this ship? Because, I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some, like, like, evil, like, literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and... That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. I saw something. This, uh, uh this old lady. I mean, she was batshit crazy and, like, dinosaur old. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? <coughs> there were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. I was very supportive. Julia, I'd never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know, it's just... Let's time out, okay? This place is too fucked up to just be fucked up. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like, something is going on here. So what do we know for sure that we can all agree on? Is this a ghost ship? This is the most insane thing I've ever asked, but are we on a ghost ship? Seems like it. So according to this letter I found, the guards here were absolutely ter- What the hell? I didn't do that. Anyone figure out what happened to all the sailors? Did they catch a rescue boat or something? Good God, everything about this ship just screams tomb. So what's with the bodies? They come with the ship? They actually look like they've been scared to death. This place is weird. There's some unnatural shit going on here. It is unsuper freaking natural. It's like this place is stuck in a perpetual bad feeling machine. What happened on this ship? What do you think actually happened on this ship? I haven't got a clue. It looked like the newspaper was from 1947. We know more than we did before. That's something at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. This ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it, that's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. That's the worst ending of this game you want to get, is calling the military. We gotta get off this damn ship. <laughs> no shit. I think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. I know it's kind of crazy, but I wonder if the plane from the dive could have been shot down by this ship.
Well, these are ruined. Can't use them. <coughs> Nothing over here. Find a way up? Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. Right here. Hey, over here, help me out. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. Pull you up. <coughs> My God, this vape is kind of good. Forgot what flavor it was, but this shit is good as hell. Oh, definitely going that way. This is... This is where I chased Conrad before. Huh. I, I thought it looked familiar. Hey, come here. Here's a way true. Not that way, obviously. Was a premonition? Find the radio yet? No, but there's got to be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. Little boy blue, hey, what's up? Thanks for stopping by. Something's wrong here. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Oh, shit. Hey, here. Perfect game clip. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? All right. There goes nothing. Uh, good old shortwave radio. It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's have some for help. Come in, please! Do you read us? Over. Uh, Over. Oh, oh, uh, okay. At least there's someone listening. Uh, the signal's in and out, though. Uh... Say nothing. Do nothing. Do not alert the military. Don't. Come on! 
Be right back. Okay. Yo, guys, check it out. Look, I got a be right back emoji I can use. Hey, look at this. This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I gotta be honest. I don't think I'm gonna make it down there in my shape. I'll go, obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Hey, little bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? You stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. You're kind of mixing metaphors there. Not if the pitcher's a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. So what do you think? Hey, if you're sure you're up for it, I believe you got it, bro. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julia, no. Not my bodyguard. I can take care of myself. Julia says she can handle it. I'm still the captain, so I'm going. I'm gonna say if Julia says she can handle it. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. Okay, Julia. It's you and I. Dude, <laughs> scream like a bitch. Well, he did. Well, at least those still work. Broken bones. Everything still work? Everyone okay? We're okay. What are we gonna do? We have to find a generator. We gotta find out where we are. Uh, we'll go confident. We're gonna have to find <coughs> a generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. Okay, we'll wait here by the radio. Here. Hey. After you. I'm guessing these are the lower levels. Talking about the two dudes. Joe was in sick bay. So I guess there was a fight or something. Dude named Charlie ended up in the brig. Ten days. That's quite a stint for a little fight. Yeah, it is. I wish I could actually you know, enjoy this. What the hell are you talking about? Well, in any other circumstance, you know, this place would be the coolest place to explore. Like, like Apple. I'm gonna say no. Maybe this was somebody's son from on board? It was. Oh, barf. Yeah, he did. I think I got one, two, three, four more pictures. Well, I guess this is the only way.
Can't go that way, so we're going down. Hey. Look at this. Looks like the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? The ladder's broken off here. I think I can just wait. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah, you won tit in the shot away. Yeah, uh, <clears throat> all good. Just come down. <sighs> oh, God. What's up? That, it, 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 it was. Wait, wait, didn't you see it? Um, hello? Okay, so, I, so I'm seeing things, but you're not. Okay, so. Follow my thinking here. We know this ship was carrying Manchurian gold, which was actually some kind of dangerous chemical, right? And there's this like weird fog everywhere, all over the place. Maybe that's the Manchurian gold. And maybe it's fucking us all up, like in the head, you know? I mean, I definitely saw some crazy shit that I could have sworn was real, but maybe it wasn't. We know the crew were scared shitless of something. None of it happened. None of it was real. It was just a hallucination. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. I mean, maybe there was a connection? Maybe they made contact? It's a theory, I guess. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. All righty, let's keep going. According to this, you know what? Actually, no. let me put this in a quick break, real quick. I'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. I miss right now. Dry clothes? Yeah. Nothing in there? I got it! Yes! 
this thing still works. Yeah, this is definitely what we're looking for. No wonder the power keeps cutting out. Just throw the switch, and let's get back upstairs. Okay, let's get back upstairs. There's gotta be another way up. <laughs> we lost power, but we have it back. Can you hear me? Over! Please state your situation, over. We need help, now! There are things on the ship that are trying to hurt us. Over. Oh my God! Don't do that! Don't do it! Don't do it! Don't do it! Our location is 12 degrees 30 minutes south. 151 degrees 20 uh, minutes west. Ah, we're fucked. Please get here now. We need help. We're fucked. We're on a freighter, abandoned, huge and old. He just fucked us. We're gonna get the worst ending in this game. Look, look at this. Oh, hey, it's the rebreather. The fisherman must have brought it over from the Duke of Milan. You think it still works? Looks like it's got a little juice left. Maybe a couple of minutes. Should we bring it with us? I mean, it's heavy. Take it. Hell yeah, we should. Half the boat is submerged. Salmon go Danny is slumped over. Gotta be careful. of a clue. To be careful here. There's no use hiding, you little foot. What's the problem with sharing all that gold, eh? There must be plenty of that to go around, more than enough. And we're all in this together, right? Trying to cut me out of the deal? Uh oh. You can't have 
all the gold, and I'm to be left here to die. But I am the captain. I am in control, and I am the one that says who goes and who stays. Ah. He's breathing down our necks. Please tell me you have an escape plan. We can't risk moving yet. Just need to watch and wait for an opening. Odd. Uh, mm -mm -mm -mm. Let me put my cigarette out. You're gonna smash yourself. What the fuck? You're gonna smash yourself with a big fucking hammer. That don't sound very good. Looks painful. This is a pretty big hammer. You're gonna smash yourself? I know I don't want to hurt that. Homeboy said he gonna smash himself with a big hammer. Doors were meant to withstand all sorts of stuff. Okay. okay. This is where okay. I gotta be careful. None of you move. None of you go all changing on me now. Turn around. Slow. Be slow. Okay. All right. Not changing. None of that. Raise your hands up. Slow. Hey, be careful here. No, no. Not like that. I said no changing. We'll say the respectful we got no problem with you please we've got no problem with you we just want to get out of here please i'm sorry but if you're breathing then you don't got much of a choice in the matter you don't got to say ah, not again it's all good changing on me what what's changing stay away stay back from the mist what there's no mist, man! Don't breathe it! Don't breathe the mist! Why can't we breathe the mist? What does it do? It's... life! Bringing things to life that shouldn't be alive! It's inside now! Inside with us, now! Please, just calm down! Stop! Stop! It's in one of us, isn't it? Reassuring, I haven't breathed any weird mist. I haven't breathed any weird mist. Please, I promise. Yeah, you breathed in the mist. It's happening. I can feel it. Okay, all, all right, look. I, there was, you know, something back there. Uh, maybe a mist or fog, maybe? I knew it. I told you. Did you breathe it in? No, look. We held our breath. We did not breathe any of that stuff. <laughs> oh, really? I know you're all fancy divers, but you expect me to buy that? We've been down here for hours. You've been holding your breath this whole time. You're holding your breath right now. Wait, 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 wait. wait. We have a rebreather from our boat. What? We've been using it to get the mist out of us. You know, we could use it on you too. Okay? No, 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 no! You keep that thing away from me! Oh, good. 
It's in me. I got the mist in me, don't I? It's in me, isn't it? Uh, uh, I can't feel it swirling around in there. It's changing me. On the inside. We need the breathing gear. Oh, I should have did that the first time. Yo, are you okay? Damn, we should. I, all the times I play this game, I've never done that, trying to save that dude. Wait by the radio. Why? I'm gonna check the next level. There might be some more gear down there we can use. Uh. I'm not going far. Just wait by the radio. I'm going to hang back here as well. Uh-oh. by the radio. Don't uh, run away. I wouldn't dream. I saw the, the the big guy. He had the distributor cap. Go after him. There's a curator in the background. This must have been what we just heard. Oh no, what's that? Doesn't matter. We need that distributor cap. Here! He had to have come this way. He did. I'm not gonna make this jump, Alex. I'll have to find another way around. Well, <sighs> he did.
All right, got a nice little clue. Mm, have to crack my back real quick. That shit felt good as hell. <laughs> oh shit, I should have done that. He's hallucinating the rat eating through him. Encouraging, I need you to stay calm. Alex, I need you to listen to me, okay? Something is wrong, so just try not to panic. This for Alex, stop. Alex! Oh shit. Damn. Just lost the character. And I had no control over it. Hey, you see that bullshit dart link? I even have a uh a, a Way to control that. That should just play by itself. Fuck. I hate these curators cut sometimes. But he was hallucinating. I think he saw her as a forearm monster. And we ain't got the distributor cap no more. So yeah, I'm gonna get the worst ending in this game. <coughs> yep, time to get the worst ending of the game. Well, we saved five characters, technically. I guess this is where we live now. However long that's gonna be. I've got no freaking idea. I think, realistically, we got a couple days, maybe a few more if we can salvage some rainwater. Rainwater? Great. Anyone know a good rain dance? Uh-oh. She oh. drank that beer. Hey, hey. And she got the bins. So that's two characters I lost. Oh, 
shit, shit. This is decompression sickness. We came up too fast. Oh, shit. Come on. Come on. Come on, Julia. Come on. Come on. Some bullshit. I ain't have control over that one either. <sighs> he just hey, want to touch hey. your titties. At least we can get gunned down. Gay, so let me finish my vape. You don't understand, really. I mean, just how crazy it got down there. I mean, just how fucking out of control. I guess you could say I lived my greatest nightmare. I was relentlessly stalked by a beautiful woman, and all I wanted to do was run the hell away. <laughs> we had all this new gear. And she was worried about her brother, and we weren't supposed to come up so fast, but I, I tried to stop her, but her brother, I tried to stop her. I mean, there were things down there that, you know, shouldn't have been alive, you know, kind of things that can make you go insane. I mean, hey, I'm no prude. The lady's down, then who might have be picky, but this one. <sighs> Up close, she was, um, she's not exactly getting the motor running. You know what I mean? You might even say she could melt the rubber off your tires. And not in a good way. Oh boy, still trying to smash after she died. I should have stopped her. I should have fucking stopped her. That's it. Oh, here, watch the uh, post credit scene. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again, see if you can't do better next time around. Not a bad effort. Some lived, some died. All your fault. Fuck you. It wasn't my fault. And the distributor cap? Boom. Unfortunate. It's all about decisions, isn't it? Decisions made in a hurry, in a panic, made with the heart instead of the head, or vice versa. 
Sometimes those decisions take a long time to have repercussions. But there are repercussions. There are always repercussions. Till we meet again, maybe in Little Hope, maybe somewhere else. But be certain, we will meet again. It's inevitable. I am inevitable. Got the Thanos quote going. Want to spare me over till another year? Want to spare me over? Want to spare me over till another year? Or I do believe that was the end of the game. Till another year. Want to spare me over till another year? Want to spare me over till another year? Hey. Uh, hey! What's going on, man? Hey! Come on! I just saw someone in the woods. Whoever it was, they're gone. Going to okay, very good. Who's there? I fashioned her with my own hand. <laughs> That's going to be the next game I stream. Alrighty, 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 alrighty. This is Trey Hardy here from the good old Killer Instinct Squad. I'm going to go ahead and end the broadcast there, but on YouTube. Make sure you thumbs up, comment, subscribe. This video has been fun. Shout out to, uh... Darkling Vortex for moderating. Shout out for the little boy blue and the uh, Demon Wolf Lore for stopping by the stream. Uh, we'll see you in the future on some more epic gaming adventures. Peace.